What's up guys, welcome back to Unbox Junkie. My name is Matt and today we are looking at the Icon by EOZ Audio. Now I'm pretty sure these are actually pretty new because when I went to look on Amazon after they were sent to me, I only found one review. The review was not good. So as of right now, these actually only have one star, which I find that kind of odd because we've looked at them before and they actually have really good quality products. They sound great, at least from what we've tested out before. I'll leave that down below also if you wanna check that out. I forgot which one it was. Either way, um, I'm gonna see for myself if it's actually worth one star. All right, so these are six millimeter drivers. They're running off of Bluetooth 5.0. Obviously, they're very reminiscent of the AirPods, so anybody out there who likes the AirPod style, this might be for you. Maybe you don't like Apple. Now, these are IPX6 rated, so they are pretty much water resistant. They're not technically waterproof. You probably could get away with wearing these in the shower if you wanted to, considering they're IPX6. But man, look at that little tiny case. Now they're saying that their, their six millimeter graphene coated drivers will give you pristine quality. Uh, I hope they're right. Now this is fully up to date. As you can see, it's got a USB to USB type C cable for charging. We got some extra ear cups, pretty basic ear cups, nothing too uh, fancy. Now the case, again, this case is super clean looking. I really like this, it's really super small. You've got your USB type C port for charging and I believe these are LED indicators. Oh. Look at those. Oh, those are super clean. I think these look way better than the AirPods. Oh, that is very nice. So as you can see at the bottom, you've got your microphone on both of them. You've got the little touch panel on the side. Very classy looking. You get that ergonomic curve, which is always lovely. You've got the connection points on the back, but I like that little chrome piece at the bottom. I think that looks pretty clean. There you go, magnetic case. Now the earbuds themselves, they're saying that you get about three and a half to four hours. These are 35 milliamp hour batteries. Um, so they're not gonna last very long, but the charge case is an 800 milliamp hour battery. In total, you should get about 25 hours of battery out of it. As soon as you open it, they turn on and they're immediately ready to go. Oh. Okay. I uh, I don't know, they feel, they feel a little loose. No, they stayed. Oh. They're kind of moving though. There we go, the EOZs. Immediate connection, and it said it in both? All right, let's crank this up. I have it max volume, and I can hear myself. They're not very loud. Pause, 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 pause. Interesting, okay, so I'm just now learning that this is not really the touch, the touch function. You see that little dot right there? That's the touch function, so... No, it works really well. Yeah, I got it at max volume. These are not very loud at all. I mean, I'm talking just fine. I can hear myself just fine. It sounds great, just no volume. That's sad. Well, they sound okay. The bass is there, um, but it's just not getting loud. Now, I'm gonna try the one by itself. Okay, this one's still going. All right, let's switch them. Okay, I don't know if you guys could hear that, but it just, as I picked it up, it was going and then it said connected. All right, let's make a phone call. Oh, that sounds good. Hello? Wow. I don't know, you sound louder than all the other music that I just got done trying to listen to. You can hear yourself? Oh, it just hung up. I just hung up on her. Oops. Yeah, I accidentally hung up on you. <laughs> so, okay, so I accidentally hung up on you, and now that I've called you back, you still hear yourself, but you sound like a robot. Okay, so mic no bueno, volume no bueno. Okay. That's a shame. And these things are 90 bucks. Yeah, too bad. All right, I'm going to try this max volume booster app. All right, turn it up to 130%. Let's see if that made a difference. Okay, hold on. Let's try that bass boosted one more time. Oh, okay, that sounds bad. That's like crazy distorted. Okay, okay, so you can use a volume booster, uh, but it sounds like they get distorted pretty easily when you do that, so yeah. I'm just gonna go ahead and leave that on. I'll do a distance check. I'll be right back. Um, all right, well, that's actually pretty good. I got to my max distance, which is around 55 feet or so, and uh, there was zero skipping. Um, so the connection is really good. <sighs> it's really unfortunate, because, uh, you know, these seem like they would be really good earbuds. It's kind of sad. They don't have any kind of volume control. 
um, within the earbuds themselves. I think it's a real big plus, the uh, being able to switch back and forth either one or both with nothing in between to like reconnect or anything, that's great, that's a big plus. We need to see more of that in true wireless earbuds. Um, so in that case, they did a really good job. I think build quality is fantastic. The case actually looks really good, but I would definitely say as of right now, I'm hoping this is like the Gen 1, and right now they're just looking for feedback on how to improve them. I can't agree with one star review. I would probably give it more like a two and a half or three right now, and again, only because there's no power. They don't have any power. Um, I can't really recommend this to anybody right now. If I spent $90 on something like this, I'd be pretty disappointed too, for sure. I would hope that uh, EOZ takes the this criticism in, in a positive, constructive way and uh, maybe do some improvements. Maybe make a uh, maybe make an Icon version too. Um, if that happens, hit me up and I'll definitely take a look at them. But as for now, I'm gonna have to pass on these. But uh, if you are still interested, I'll leave the link down below. <laughs> anyway, guys, that is it. I'm gonna leave links down in the description below as usual. I leave it in your hands, but as for now, get out of here. Recording, recording, and done on this camera over here, okay? I am not making fun of anybody. Do not put that on me, Ricky Bobby. Today we are looking at the Icon by EOZ Audio, or EOZ. Now, I, they're definitely moving, but they do stay. Let's try it. Let's try a hardcore one. It's, oh, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, this ear, ignore this ear, it's acting up. Such an embarrassment. Can't take me anywhere. Again, my left ear hole is... <laughs> I don't know, I need a special customized ear cup. Anybody out there, any companies out there wanna work with me and make me some custom ear cups? Hit me up, we'll talk. I would say it's a pass. This one didn't budge, this one did because my left ear is just, uh, I don't know. My, my left ear hole is complicated. You wouldn't understand. It's getting too personal. Let's move on. What is shaking? Stop, stop shaking. It's my remote for the new light that's behind me. It's making too much noise, shut up. Okay. Who's banging? Don't y'all know I'm recording here? And now the dog's barking. <laughs>